This is my rifle. There are many like it, but this one is mine. Hi, I'm Jason with Armory.net, and today we're going to review Denix's non-firing M16A1. Let's do this. The M16A1 assault rifle is one of the most iconic military rifles of all time. It was designed by Eugene Stoner in the late 1950s and entered military service in 1964. It was a standard service rifle for U.S. troops until 1983 when it was replaced by the A2. This replica has an overall length of 38 inches and a weight of 7.5 pounds. Most of this gun is made from zinc alloy, but the handguard and the stock are made from composite plastic. This weapon is pretty detailed. It has a bayonet stud and a functioning charging handle that cocks the weapon. And of course the trigger discharges it. And I know I complain about the orange plug in every review, but because of the flash suppressor, it's even more obvious on this replica. This weapon does have a removable clip. I'm gonna push right here to release it. The clip, however, does not adjust, so you cannot put any rounds in there. Put it back in. My only criticism is that the clip does rattle a little bit. Although this is a really great looking replica, there were a few things I was a little disappointed about. The selector, bolt release, and forward assist are all non-functioning and are only for aesthetics. And that's my review of Denix's non-firing M16A1. If this review is helpful, please subscribe and share below. It's very helpful for us and we appreciate it. And I do want to do a shout out for Truth Seeker. Truth Seeker, I promise I'm not going to blow your head off. But at the beginning of all my reviews, I do a famous quote. And if you email us at info at armory.net where that quote came from, you get entered into a drawing to where you could win a lot of really cool stuff. So if you need a replica, remember armory.net because realism matters.